And there was a tragedy at a Little League field on Long Island where a 10-year-old boy collapsed and died while running to first base. CBS 2's Alex Gaynor spoke with his heartbroken family in Long Beach. Laser LaPena had just gone on a cruise with his family yeah, and baby. celebrated his 10th birthday on Wednesday. Friday was his first Little League game of the season. He got a really nice hit, uh, barrel of the bat. Uh, he knew it, uh, the crowd was going crazy. His father, Greg, was coaching. He was so excited. Uh, he looked over to me, uh, smile from ear to ear. He says he looked down for just a moment to mark down the hit in the scorebook. I hear Jerry yell that Laser's having a seizure and he fell to the ground on first base. Jerry is Laser's 11 year old brother who was coaching first base at the time. His father says Laser had epilepsy but was nearly a year seizure free and was on medication. Long period of CPR. Uh, he just didn't make it. People have been leaving flowers, baseballs, and baseball caps here at the ballpark. The family says support from the community is what's helping them get through this. It's, it's touching. His brothers are holding on to memories of playing together. He always played game with me. Laser was a really good kid. He he would always want to like. We would always play Madden. Mets were everything to him. The Jets, everything. And after years of changing up his uniform number, this season he finally picked one he wanted to stick with. I always want to be number nine. His father says the rest of the team's season is dedicated to Laser. May they play with as much passion and joy as he did. In Long Beach, Alice Gaynor, CBS 2 News. And other teams are paying tribute here tonight by putting their baseball bats out on their porches and also using the hashtag bats out for Laser.